25 on one side and the zero on the other, sir. I'm uh, happy about the W. Um, I got you know, it. It's all about getting the win right here Thank on the road at Furman. A tough place to play, a tough team to play, so that was a really good victory. This game can so much be about momentum, and it was all Sanford's today. A big three and out on the opening possession of the contest against the Furman offense, and then lo and behold, a block punt, big play in special teams that really got you going. Yeah, that was big. You know, we wanted to kind of start, you know, fast and, and get going, and, and, you know, we had the opportunity right there. The kids came out, we got a big stop, and then um, somebody got through and blocked the punt right there. I'm not even sure at this point. I think it might have been Dion. We thought Dion Pierre, yes, um, but, yeah. But, uh, you know, great effort right there, and then uh, Jay scooped Jay the end yep. zone, and that was big. That juiced the team and got us going, and, you know, and then our offense followed through after that. It just kind of yeah. started going. Jumped on this Furman offense, and again, held them, I think, on a total to, uh, they ended up with, what, 133 passing yards, 119 on the ground, 252 total, but a couple of big takeaways, and that was something big. The chance to go get that football, you guys did it at least twice today. Right, that was such a great feeling, man. I, I got my first INT, man. It was such a great feeling, you know. I was surprised that he threw it, but he threw it and <laughs> came down with it. So I was surprised and I was so happy. Like, Congrats. Another of the big plays that the Sanford defense came up with to help this team to victory. The led 7 nothing after 90 seconds. Uh, another three and out. Get the football back. And on the first offensive snap, 62-yard connection between quarterback we'll Michael Eubank and wide yeah, receiver yeah, Terrell yeah. Hamilton. The kind of quick strike offense we've known this offense had the capability of all year. Yeah, we have that ability. You know, when we feel like we've missed some offs at times and some of those, and we hit, them, hit some today. And, you know, Corral's really playing well, and Michael continues to get better. And, you know, it was, it was exciting to see them connect right there. And, again, it just added more juice for us. A career day on the afternoon. Uh, Corral with nine catches, 206 yards, and a touchdown. And Corral, that first 62-yard uh, touchdown, came on the first offensive snap of the day. And what a way to get this offense going. Uh, it was a great way to get it going. Uh, Coach was talking about all week, you know, uh, when you're one-on-one matchups. And on that play, I won one-on-one, -on -one, and Mike gave me a good ball. I just have to finish it off after that. Mike gave you a bunch of good balls today. We talked about the nine catches, and Scott Harris and I were talking throughout today's broadcast. I think it's five straight weeks now. We've watched Michael Eubank put up career highs in passing numbers. This guy's getting better and better every week. Uh, I think he's just, uh, you know, just understanding the offense every week. And uh, Coach Trick is helping him out real good. And, you know, we're helping him out real good, just trying to do things with him. We're going to do good things for next week. His biggest competition today came from a wideout, Malik Johns, who threw two touchdown passes today. How cool was that? Uh, it was great, man. I love Malik. You know, me and him both from the same place. I love that, man. It's like a little brother, man. Well, look, great man. Going to make for a fun bus ride home and what we hope will be a fun home coming. And a lot of folks will be on campus next week. It should be a big crowd, a big game, and a, and a chance to reward the Sanford faithful and the Sanford team for all they've accomplished. Yes, sir, it should. Thank you so much. You've got Terrell Hamilton with us, our Bulldog offensive player of the game today. As the dogs scored a 45 to nothing victory here on the road at Paladin Stadium in Greenville, South Carolina.